The uh, growing crisis on our border, new offensive this morning to stop the flood of children crossing illegally into this country. You remember those dramatic images this week, the bus carrying so many of those families stopped by angry protesters and told to turn around and go back. ABC's Jim Avila is at the White House this morning with the latest on this. Jim, good morning. Good morning, David. With only 96 beds for the thousands of Central American moms and kids crossing the border illegally, the Department of Homeland Security is overwhelmed. So today, a new offensive from the Border Patrol, a TV campaign with commercials on both sides of the border and seen exclusively this morning on GMA. This morning, the first look at new TV commercials designed to discourage the overwhelming tide of Central American children and their mothers crossing the Texas border illegally. Dramatic stories made in telenovela fashion to be played here in the United States and in El Salvador, Honduras, and Guatemala, showing a young teen saying goodbye to his mother and father and heading to America only to be found a victim of the dangerous journey. Es cierto. Ellos son nuestro futuro. At a press conference in the Rio Grande Valley, the Border Patrol Commissioner personally warned Central American parents that the trip north has become more treacherous. If you cross illegally into the United States, you are putting yourself and your children in grave danger. The Border Patrol is also launching radio spots and billboards designed to counter the notion that the immigrants are getting a free pass in the U.S. because there are minors or traveling with minors. A tough sell since the overwhelming number of moms and kids coming across illegally are allowed within days to take buses to be with family already in the United States. And right now, of course, these kids and their moms are released to go anywhere in the U.S. they want, hopping on buses with just a promise to appear in court. And our sources say most of them do not.